to my channel so today's video we're going to be talking about hair and I wanted to do it was supposed to be a my most uh, repurchased products whole wise like hair skin face makeup body everything but when I was taking all the products that I said oh I recently bought this oh I rebought this oh I rebought this or oh, I rebought this and I just had so much of hair um a little pause pause if you hear tingling and you hear a little tiny squeaky voice, that is my one year old, actually a year and a half, um, that more than a year and a half. I keep saying that he's one and a half and he's going to be two in like three months. So my little toddler is with me and usually I try to record when he's sleeping, but today he just doesn't want to go to sleep. See puppy. Anyway, so I'm sorry. If you hear him through the video, I'm a mother and with a YouTube channel, so I mean, it's just part of. So, again, this video is going back to the beginning. It's going to be repurchase products uh, hair-wise. I have a lot of issues with my hair at the moment. Um, you guys, excuse my hair. I am talking about hair and my hair does not look whatsoever appropriate for camera. But I was like, I have to record because I haven't recorded in a very very long time so I gotta get back into recording mode and besides I have an awesome friend who I have to give thumbs up to um, he's an awesome photographer he actually came by my house and fixed up my lighting and not only that I recently got a ring light so I'm really excited about that I received the ring light I think it was last week and I was just like jumping up for joy because I was like ah! So he came and he set up the lightings and he set up my camera so it doesn't look yellowish and I look a little more professional. So thank you, uh, host, uh, what is it, uh, Julio? Thank you, Julio, for that. I really, really, I really, really appreciate it. And um, I'm not gonna talk, I'm gonna make this intro long, but I should because I haven't talked to you guys in like forever. So, but anyways, we're gonna jump into my re my most repurchased products for the hair. So we're going to start off by saying that. I wear a lot of hair extensions. My company that I go to for hair extensions is Luxury for Princess. You guys know I've done many reviews on them. I always uh, wear them and I always tag them so you guys can know that the thickness, the volume, the fullness, the length of my hair is actually because of Luxury for Princess. My hair right now is like up to my shoulders when it's curly and a little bit lower than my shoulders when it's straight. Um, I had a very rough situation with it. My hair was so long. My hair was all the way, uh, I think it was the bottom of my bra strap. And I started noticing that the more I kept using hair extensions, the more it started breaking. And I was like, oh my God. So when I recently got it ombre, I had the guy kind of chop it off a little bit, but I guess it was too much. And my hair doesn't grow fast, ladies. I had to tell you, there's people here. It, it, there's. I have a friend that she actually just like, cuts her hair on June and August she has it all the way to her waist. I don't, that doesn't happen to me so I'm struggling with that. Um, so I started noticing that my hair started breaking off a little bit. I'm not sure if that has to do with my nutrition or with the hair extensions but I started seeing that a year and a half ago to now my hair, no se papi, buscalo. Buscalo, mira allí en el piso. Buscalo por el piso. So I started seeing that my hair started breaking off a lot and I can't tell you it was because of the hair extensions. I may think it's a little bit because of the hair extensions just because remember you are applying a lot of hair, a lot of um, weight onto your scalp. That kind of tends to start breaking off your hair. I'm not saying hair extensions are bad. Don't quote me on that. I love my hair extensions and I will continue to use them. But I'm trying to lay off on them a little bit just so my hair can breathe. So. I am actually like very, very like um, strict when it comes down to taking care of my hair because I took it for granted. <laughs> so I have to start off with my conditioner and my shampoos. Um, when it's w w when you see my hair all shiny and, and smooth and soft and whatever, I have to give credits to, of course, my holy grail shampoo and conditioner, which are the L'Oreal Advanced Hair Hair Care. Total Repair 5. I bought their line which it was the Total Repair 5 Extreme and it kind of just like made my hair horrendous. So I said, you know what? 
I am done trying new products for my hair. I'm sticking to what I know has worked for me for years and I know that it's definitely worth every single penny and this is like four bucks, five bucks at the drugstore. So on that same line, my holy grail go-to, um, I would say a deep conditioner, it's the from their same line, it's called Advanced Hair Care Total Repair 5 and it's their damage erasing balm. I absolutely love, love this thing right here. It repairs up to five years of damage in one use and he just slammed his head against the wall and he didn't even cry. So let's move on. So the next thing here it says uh, pretty much the same thing, deeply repairs and reconstructs. Dry technically uh, treated hair. I don't have my glasses, I'm blind as a bat. So I love this thing, I don't do it often. I do it, I tend to wash my hair once every four or five days. Just because my hair is so dry, I like the natural oils of my hair to sink into my hair. And it's very hard to process my hair, so I just like, uh, I get lazy. That's why I have my dry shampoos. So I use this pretty much twice a month. I don't want to overdo it because I don't want to weigh my hair down. So when I'm like doing my, my hair, my blow dryer or iron it, it tends to look like very oily. It's because I'm doing too much of this. But this together with that, amazing results lady. I you guys know I give you my 100% on opinion. I'm not getting paid for me telling you the product works. I'm just giving you 100% opinion. So the next thing moving down to hair care, we're still at like hair care wise. The Neutrogena Triple Repair. So this is the Triple Repair. It mends split ends, straightens brittle hair, and, prote and protects from breakage. What is wrong with me? And protects from breakage. Fortifying leaving con treatment, leaving treatment. So this is pretty much when I'm doing that. And note, if I'm doing this, I'm not doing this because it's just too much for my hair and it's definitely gonna weigh it down and make it more oily than what already is. So when I don't do this, I normally do this one and leave it on my hair. And says it's for dull dye, for dull damaged hair and safe, it's safe for color treated hair. So if you have your hair color treated, it's safe for you. It's the Nexus Salon Hair Care and this is the Hydrolyte Weightless Moisture Root Lift Mist to lift hair for added fullness and body. So this pretty much gives you body, gives you volume on your hair. I tend to just sort of do a little mist on the roots of my hair just on this area right here and I have to tell you it doesn't give me like bam boom volume but it definitely helps me with that whole way down that I have on my hair it definitely helps I have actually this is my second bottle I'm not gonna tell you that I've gone crazy and I have like seven bottles of these no I, this is actually my second bottle and I absolutely love this thing right here I actually saw it on Nicole Guerrero Guerrero I really don't know how to pronounce her name but Nicole um, I saw it on her and I said I gotta try it and ever since I saw it and I tried it I absolutely love it so I really really recommend that if you're trying to look for a little bit of a root lift that's what it's called a little bit of a root lift it's actually not like a volumizer it's like a root lift so the next thing it's my hair serum this is what it's called and it's the bio silk silk therapy ladies I cannot live without this this is hands down my most repurchase product uh, to hand in hand with my shampoo and conditioner. These babies are really expensive for like a bottle. I think it was like $18 to be honest, just this little bottle. But a little bit goes a very long way. It lasts me for about six months to eight months to be honest. Because what I do is I take a little bit when my hair is uh, towel dried and I apply it mostly to the ends of my hair. And then when I style my hair, I then apply a little bit more to the whole entire hair. Just to actually remove any freeze and actually just give it a little more of a silky smooth finish to my hair like i've actually seen like the big bottles at tgi or tgi fridays <laughs> i can't believe i'm thinking about food sorry i've actually seen them at tj max <laughs> i actually seen them at ross and i think i saw them at marshall i'm not pretty sure don't quote me in there but definitely tj max has them and they have it for a very very reasonable price that you would rather get at wherever you buy it so the next thing down for hair care is, ooh, did you see that? That looked very um, cool. <laughs> the next thing is, of course, this is a must. You ref definitely, definitely need this in your life if you heat your hair. If you curl it, you straighten it, come on. You know, it's 
little, uh, I think it's a small portion of girls in the world who are so blessed, blessed, to actually just wash their hairs, come out of the shower, air dry it, and it's beautiful. Bless you girls if you have hair like that. Keep it, treat it, love it, show respect because believe me, if you're a girl like me that you get out of the shower and you need to hide, like hibernate so nobody can seize your hair, then I'm sorry. <laughs> this is the Tresemme Thermal Creation. This is the heat tamer leaving spray and it works with heat appliances, protects against heat damage. Self-explanatory. It definitely helps you protect your hair. Don't be like me and take your hair for granted and just say you have beautiful hair. Just one curling iron a week is not going to hurt. It will definitely hurt. Always, always protect it with the heat just like you'd protect your skin when you're out in the sun and you're going to get a suntan or you're going to go to the pool or the beach. You apply your, you apply your um, sunscreen. This is the same thing. Apply your sunscreen to your hair because your hair does not need to feel all that heat come on <laughs> so and the only thing that also kept me from actually buying this again was then because i saw like oh my god awesome it smells amazing very few it smells so good very few hair products smell really good and the ones i buy because they have so much chemical in it to treat your hair that it really doesn't smell that good but this one smells really really good my dry shampoo the dove dry invigorating dry shampoo so this is the dry shampoo and I buy it at Walgreens or Walmart and definitely with a puppy. So I definitely buy this one all the time and I'm actually running out of this one and because it's really really cheap because it's really really good. It smells really really good. The only thing is that you have to apply it for a very far distance to your hair because it leaves that white powdery residue and if you don't tap it down it's definitely going to look like you put baby powder in your forehead. Scalp. The next one is I lost a cap. I mean, this is something normal in me. And it's the Batiste Dry Shampoo for Dark Deep Brown Hair. And it has a hint of color. I have seen that it doesn't leave that white powder residue because it actually have that, that, that tint or something. And it smells really good. I gotta say, the smell is not bad. It doesn't smell like hairspray like most shampoos sometimes do smell. I like my dry shampoos to actually give me sort of a lift to my hair and actually have that refreshing smell. And this one has both. It actually gives me some volume and it actually gives me a nice fresh smell. And I absolutely love it. And it says that it's instant hair refresh for dark hair. So if you have dark hair, they actually have one. They have the original one, they have the cherry one, they have for the blonde, they have for everything. I think Batiste, when it comes down to um, dry shampoos, are really good. They are kind of the pricey side when it comes to dry shampoo. It's not $4 or $3 like the dough. It's sort of like $8 or $9, but it's definitely worth it, girl. When it comes to styling my hair and I want the curls to stay in place, I go for the L'Oreal Elnet Satin uh, hair, hair Spray. And I have this little bottle and I only buy the little bottles. You will say, why would you buy the little bottles first? Just buy the big bottle. The reason is that when I do my curls and I have my hair extensions, sometimes the curls tend to start falling during the day. And I have the little hairspray with me in my purse. And what I do is I retouch my curls, meaning I apply a little bit of the hairspray and sort of start um, bouncing them up so it kind of like grabs on the hairspray. So that's why I have the little bottle. I don't have the big bottle because I don't want to be... Oh, hold on. And I have like the big bottle of hairspray and you see me on at work or whatever so that's the reason why I have the little bottle but I love it because it doesn't crunch out my hair but it definitely gives me leaves it holding in place the style that I do to my hair so I absolutely love love that hairspray it's kind of the spicy side because it's sort of like a designer hairspray for the drugstore now if you have like I always say if you have any products that you try your hair is chemically processed and you do a lot of heat treatments to it and it's very dry and damaged and you sort of use something so I want to know what are your hair products. I really want to know um, if you have my type of hair. What have you used that has actually started to work? What have you used to actually make your hair strong, stronger and make it grow? Because right now it's just, mine is just like being rebellious with. So thank you so much for sticking till the end. Be blessed precious pearls. I will see you on my next video. Bye.